So that's uh, good. I mean, it'd be nice. Yeah. I think it's the best thing. It's very good. Friend. What are you doing? Just giving them a little sneak preview. Mm -hmm. That is uh, everyone. Just that's a little bit of the universe that Brian, what are you going to just give them a little hint of what you're going to say about that bit of the universe? This is the Whirlpool Galaxy. So there we go, that's the trailer for you, it's the best we can do. Hello, welcome to Backstage in Columbus, Ohio. And uh, this is, uh, I've had a lovely day in Columbus, Ohio, I've had a very nice time uh, looking at all of the, uh, the art not just in the museum but all over the place including some fantastic topiary very interesting topiary anyway uh, that's one of uh, brian's magical jackets just th there one of th no over there there we go that's it just there um so uh artist manifest oh, it says very exciting the sofa i was just sitting on johnny mathis might have sat there and if you don't know that much about johnny mathis apart from when a child is born and that kind of thing um read john waters role models book which has a really great chapter about johnny mathis lovely chapter Oh, what have I looked at? Let's see. Uh, I've had. I, I just realised I'd opened one on one that I'd done before. Um, okay, let's try this one. Not done this one before. Uh, Art manifesto for the day. This is uh, manifesto Chinese United Overseas Artists, a group of distant Chinese artists in exile. This is from 1985. We are artists from China. We have seen the profound influence of classical Chinese art on the world. We have also seen the rapid development of modern Western art in the last century. What concerns us is the current state and future of Chinese art. We are happy to see changes in China in recent years, but looking back we must conclude that Chinese art has just experienced its darkest century in history. Opposites complement each other. We respect differences and uphold pluralism. These are our beliefs. The world is watching closely the future of Chinese art. So that was uh, also allowed. We look at the concept of modern art and study its trends in our search for a new beginning for Chinese art. That is today's art manifesto. This is a dressing room in Columbus. Maybe Johnny Mathis sat here while they put some makeup on him as well. It's all amazing stuff. Anyway, see you soon. So this is uh, tonight's theatre. This is uh, a beautiful theatre in Columbus, Ohio. I've had a lovely day in Columbus, Ohio. And uh, on top of that, on Thursday, Johnny Mathis was here. So Brian Cox will be walking in the steps of Johnny Mathis. We're just waiting to do uh, the sound check behind us there. Steph and uh, Natalie. Brian is uh, obviously... He's gonna. We're gonna see if we can do a kind of live rendition of. Uh, we wanted. Oh, there we are. You can. He's just in the dark, like a jazz man. Huh. Just playing. Here we are. I didn't hear it. Yeah. Last night, a <laughs> ghost collided with my head. I'm not gonna tell you any more though. The rest of it you'll find out in the show. So there we are. The jazz light. Brian Cox. We did want to put it on the stage because uh, we thought oh, it would be yeah. nice for him uh -huh. to do a few of the constellations uh, while also playing some jazz standards. But he said no. So anyway, there you go. Now you can hear us amplified. What are you going to say, Brian Cox? Your, your mic's being checked as well. 